Mr. President, Excellencies and distinguished colleagues, I would like to thank the Economic and Social Council for convening this ministerial de declaration of the 2022 High-Level Political Forum on Sustainable Development. The Sovereign Order of Malta reaffirms its commitment towards fully implementing the 2030 Agenda and the Sustainable Development Goals. Through our national associations, the Worldwide Relief Agency, Malteser International, and our relief course, we continue to work on the ground to pursue a shared vision, offering humanitarian assistance, particularly healthcare services, education, food and water services, combating human trafficking, treating psychological trauma, and offering emotional support. The ongoing war in Ukraine severely threatened the better future and has further exacerbated global food insecurity, specifically in poorer countries. This war is a constant reminder of the international obligation and responsibility to respect and protect human rights. To achieve the 2030 Agenda, we need to promote also the role of women. Women have a fundamental role to play in conflict prevention and dialogue. Women, but also minors, are often the first victims of human trafficking, an industry that is expanding as conflicts linger on. Poverty, wars, climate change represent a fertile ground for modern slavery, a phenomenon the Sovereign Order of Malta is actively fighting against. The challenges we face today require realistic solutions. We must continue investing in education, human capital and the digital future. We need to continue to improve the infrastructure where facilities are lacking to keep vaccines efficacious. We strongly suggest that the United Nations consider creating, under the auspices of the World Health Organization, a new global compact for dealing with infectious diseases, ultimately pre-planning a global strategy for the outbreak of future pandemics. What our role is in contributing to this great mission of sustainable development? To quote the United Nations Deputy Secretary General Amina Mohamed, faith-based organizations have a critical role to play. This is true whether you are Christian, Buddhist, Hindu, Jew, Muslim, or any other major faith. 900 years after the foundation of the Sovereign Order of Malta, we hold fast to our humanitarian mission and applaud the hundreds of thousands of volunteers, staffers, medics, and supporters providing services to the most vulnerable, the forgotten people in our world and those who are left behind. Serving them and helping the Sustainable Development Goals ensure a better future for everyone is at the heart of our mission of service. I thank you, Mr. President.